You know, if if some six foot tall, big foot bear of a man comes shambling out of the woods and say, I just caught me a little fish. And I'm like, yeah, and this, you know, this Sasquatch monster of a man comes out of the woods. And he's like, well done, champ. I'm going to be like, thank you, sir. That's going to be my response. But I'm on the Internet having a conversation on the Internet with somebody else on the Internet. And it's. It's in between even footing and them lose. I, I, I don't want to say losing a discussion, but they're, they're not really winning it either. They're not arguing their points very well. To have somebody in that position call me champ, I'm like, man, you, you got to be 100% in the right with proof, facts, and evidence, and receipts backing your shit up. You got to totally own my ass in a conversation. And then the cherry on top, the mic drop, boom, well done, champ. That seals the deal. I can't say shit in response. You fucking owned. You cashed the check that your ass wrote. But when you're in a conversation and you're not saying shit that makes sense and you just go around multiple threads and multiple topics calling people champ and mate, I'm like, bruh. You can just stop with that shit, but let's 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 go on. <coughs> Alrighty, Piddlefoot's response to Remnar. Jesus, I can only go off what I've seen in Australia. I'm not gonna read this, but this it. I super duper want you to read this. I want you to pause, and I want you to read this. I want you to read the tone that Piddlefoot takes when he responds to Ramnar. Read this. Holy fuck, he brings church. He, he bring, we're, we're talking about the, the subject is employers. A rant about the people you work for. He, he's, he's bringing fucking politics and religion. He, he's breaking all the rules. And he's kind of being a dick. He's being an ass in his response. Give all that a read. Pause and unpause, please, and thank you. Alrighty. This guy's response, not going to try and pronounce his name, or her name, their name. The public education system, blah, blah, blah. Okay, yeah. And here we go, June 20th. Yes, this is the post. All posts after 24, Piddlefoot deleted. I'll give you context in just one moment. Alrighty, so you got this post up on the screen. I want you to give that a read. Alrighty, now, I'm going to show you my comment history. This is my comment history. I made a response in the rant about employers in the U.S. thread. There's rant about employers in the U.S. I'm going to scroll down. All right. And this is the post where I responded afterwards, and I'm quoting Piddlefoot's response. As, as a matter of fact, Piddlefoot had additional responses after this. I'm making a video about this because I actually want some feedback and some input from my friends. And... If, if there was only one of you, like if there's just only one of you guys that I wanted your opinion on this, I would have made screenshots and I would have sent this to you in private and we would have talked about it and I would have gotten your opinion and I would have been satisfied. Uh, oh, pardon me. However, there is a significant number of people I want to discuss this with. 
both for new friends that I've made in the Imperion community. And I want to discuss this with some other friends that I've had for a while that know who Piddlefoot is. They know more about Piddlefoot than me. I want to discuss this with y'all, so that's why I'm making this video. Now, as I'm sitting here running my mouth, you may have read my post. I hope you did. But um, I'm going to read it out loud and give context. I have an opinion, and I have something to contribute. I have my own rant about my employers that I want to bring up. However, I kind of don't want to get attacked by Piddlefoot because... He, I mean, read it. Then speak for only Australia. It's the same thing, champ. And you know that. So why try to stir the pot, mate? Your post has nothing about the topic in it at all. I made an... Hmm. Oh, yeah. Th here we go. I had two comments. I had a whole bunch of stuff uh, deleted. So, Remnar... Shit. Okay, so Pedalfoot's talking about Australia. And someone whose post I believe he deleted was like, hey, you only speak for Australia because I'm speaking, you know, from my experience in, in the US. So somebody spoke to Piddlefoot and said, could you only speak about Australia? Piddlefoot's response, well, actually, our system, mate, is mirroring yours, so okay. On top of that, there's a chance I know just as much or more about your nation's constitution, laws, and how your government works than you. And I am betting I know more than 40% of your entire population on that subject also. You know that poor education system is something not unique to Australia, mate. I mean, listen, listen, who the fuck does this guy think he is? You know, nine times out of ten, when, when you're having a conversation with someone that knows what they're talking about, they don't have to come out and empirically state as much. Uh, a, man, a man that says he is king... A man that must tell others that he is king is no true king. A gentleman does not go around telling people he's a gentleman, okay? It is unbecoming of a lady to go around and tell everyone that she is a lady. It's unbecoming. So you shouldn't tell people to just shut up, okay? The guy he's responding to did not tell Piddlefoot to shut up. And I say that in my response. Just because it's something you don't like the sound of unless you think you live in China, a communist system where freedom of speech is not valued. Are you one of those people who thinks it's only okay for themselves to have freedom of speech? The guy basically goes on a rant. Them cancel culture on Fox do that crap. Don't be like them. So he goes on a rant and attacks somebody completely out of left field, bringing up political rhetoric. My response... I'm pretty sure he didn't tell anyone to shut up or any of the other things you mentioned. All he said was, then speak only for Australia. What you consider issues in your country does not equate to the issues in the U.S. And you drew a lot of very serious and way off-topic conclusions about that. The loaded questions you asked do more to shut down open discussion and conversation than to invite it to continue on. Piddlefoot's response to me, he tells me to then to speak only for Australia, which is weird because I don't live in Australia. I don't know where he's coming from. Same thing, champ. And you know that. So why try to stir the pot? Your post has nothing about the topic in it at all. I'm not stirring the pot. He's Piddlefoot's the one stirring the pot. I'm the one trying to calm the pot down. I'm like, hey, you know, this is the off topic forum. What is the topic for off-topic forums? And I had something to contribute, but I was a bit taken aback by your abrasive response. So I wanted to get some clarity on your post, rather than just assume if you intended it directly, than how I perceived it. 